This. Devil's Breath wasn't designed to be a weapon. It's a treatment for genetic disorders. But its current form is wildly imperfect. In trying to fix the body, it rips it apart. We need to locate Dr. Michaels. I don't trust Sable to contain something this deadly. I may have a lead on that. Charles Standish is being held at Sable's Central Park compound. If anyone knows Michael's location, it'll be Oscorp CFO. I'm trying to reach him now. Reach him? That place is crawling with guards. How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Sneaking into a Sable compound? That could go bad fast. I should head to Central Park. She is literally completely insane, MJ, in this game. Sorry, there's no world where that makes sense, what she's just doing. So I'm gonna meet MJ at Central Park, and then she's like, Yeah, Is hey, look! Peter, I've had an epiphany. It's all about the mind. Take me, for example. A mind of unlimited potential, shackled to a tired, old body. Think of what that mind could achieve if it were freed. In developing our neural interface, we need to think beyond replicating the tired putterings of our physical forms. Instead, reach into imagination and possibility. Reach into the mind. I've never heard Doc this excited by a project. He's not too excited. Uh, to be honest, it sounds as if Doc has really lost it already. Not a good sign. I was even before she went. Yeah, and she doesn't have that many either. That gap in the fence looks promising. Just need to distract the guard. Oh, won't let me. I have to lure him. Like, literally, it forces you to lure him. I could have taken him out really easily, but no. Oh yeah, I can't take him out yet. I don't have the gun. Check on our house guest. Stay here. Copy. House guest. Must be Standish. He's here somewhere. So I have to get up there. Need to draw him away from the stairs. Honestly, he just doesn't want to move this guy, yeah? What the? Luckily, there are a bunch of morons, so I can get past them. What's that? Demons are killing anyone related to Devil's Breath. Yeah. Standish is in real danger. Oh. You mean... As opposed, as opposed to fake danger. <laughs> Standish, I knew it. I've got to get to that tent. Standish is secure, ma'am. Lockout comms as well. Not what leaks depressed about Michael's or Devil's breath. On it. She's nervous. Standish must know something about Dr. Michaels. Crap. Generator tripped. I won't distract him for long.
looking. Convoy gonna be ready? Five by five. Whew. Get that truck moving. Should have been uptown half an hour ago. Copy. We're rolling. Damn it, I should have. I should have used the I should have used the truck there. Made a big mistake. But. A lot of them there. <sighs> Made it. Just because I was that close, so. Bravo and Charlie are both on deck for Dr. Michael's relocation, ma'am. Add two more units. He carries the only sample of Devil's Breath. I will not be responsible for pandemic. Understood, ma'am. I don't care how many men Sable has, she won't be able to stop Martin Lee. Very tricky. How do I get past both of them? Also, I'm gonna throw this one here, maybe. Stay away from the box. Go all the way around here. I'll throw that one there. And then get down. This works nicely. That's important. The safe houses. If Dr. Michaels is in one of these, Standish might know which one. Gotta move. There's Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries devil's breath around with him. Osborne doesn't trust anyone else to secure it. It's definitely the best way to get past them for sure. This is the last guy. Things I might finally have managed. Charles Standish? Holy crap! Charles! Where is Dr. Morgan Michaels? Lee sent you. Didn't he? No. <laughs> if he wants to kill me, you tell him to do it. Do it himself. I'm not with the demons. I'm not with Sable. I'm a reporter. Even worse. I think you'd prefer the demons. Stopped. Just like you. What? I've read your byline. Sable won't listen to me. She has Michaels in the Bowery. They're moving him to a new safe house tomorrow at noon. But she's totally ignoring Grand Central. Grand Central? The demons were talking about it when they held me. They're going there to get... To get what, Charles? What do the demons need to get at Grand Central? <laughs> what the... Charles! Oh! What that the was hell? not a Sable guy. Definitely not a Sable guy. Sorry, Charlie. Okay, time to Wait, go. No, he knows something. Oh, a bunch of morons. 
Now, MJ is going to blame Peter for saving her life. She is very entitled. <laughs> well, that was maybe the most awkward swing of my life. MJ is not happy. Hey, okay, another thing. Sorry, Charlie. <laughs> You knock a man out, destroy my background research, and the best you've got is sorry, Charlie? Is everything a joke to you? What? MJ, no, I, I screwed up. It, it was a tension breaker. Tension breaker, right. You know this is exactly why we broke up. I thought we broke up so you could focus on your career. We broke up because you wouldn't stop treating me like a baby. Don't do this, MJ. Don't do that, MJ. Oh, that's too dangerous, MJ. I may not have super spider powers, but I'm not made out of glass. You snuck into the middle of an armed military. You know what? Can we not do this right now, please? Did you learn anything about Dr. Michaels? <sighs> Fine. <sighs> Michaels is in the Bowery somewhere. Sable's moving him tomorrow at noon. Awesome. Anything else? Was he saying something about Grand Central before I jumped in? He was. <sighs> no. It was nothing. Listen, I gotta go, Peter. Filing deadline. Oh my Peter. god. That's how you know she's still mad. Peter. Nice work, Mr. Superhero. My goodness, she is so entitled and crazy. Gotta blow off some steam on patrol. She's absolutely crazy. Like, she doesn't have spider powers, she jumps into like military bases and then get complaints if you save her. I mean this version of MJ is insane. That's my personal opinion.